Six scorchers. Six scorchers, really. Son of a... Alright, Defiance Rebels, Boom Beach. This is Plain Pants here, and uh, I'm going to show you Andrew's attack, because this was legit. This is like a two-stage Zuka raid. And I am still in China, so this is China Part 2. But I'm traveling home today, and I'll be back today, which will be yesterday here, and is tomorrow there. So... That's interesting. I really, uh... I don't know how many of you guys... Rad, I'm probably in Rad's time zone right now. Or pretty close. He's in Australia. He's in Australia, mate. And he's probably... Here with me today. Today. While you're in yesterday. <laughs> I'm gonna stop doing that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is great this is straight for the so he already took out three rocket launchers okay already three la rocket launchers taken out let's see how many he can take out now since I already saw this I'm going to say five more And I have like a 100% chance of being totally right. I love this. He goes, he takes out that key defense, goes back into the smoke, and then brings his troops, what little remains, behind those rocket launchers to protect them as much as possible. And you can see as soon as they come out of the smoke, he does the exact perfect thing, which is throw some critters down Protects them against those cannons just long enough to take down those rocket launchers. What a great attack. Now I'm just going to save you the trouble and tell you that the rest of the, the attack is, is kind of boring. <laughs> but but that, those first three minutes were excellent. <clears throat> Look at all that key defense is just gone. Three rocket launchers, three more rocket launchers, two more rocket launchers. It doesn't get any better than that. Or does it? Or does it? How about flaring your remaining troops right over some mines? Wait for it. Wait for it. No, that's not going to help. Oh. <laughs> now how does a dainty little thing like that turn into a nasty old skull like that? Well, it's just how it goes, I guess. Yeah, those little... Oh, wow, those little med kit crosses. I never even noticed that before. I don't know, my voice cracks like I'm an adolescent. So interesting. The things you you uh, you notice when you're sleep deprived and in China. <laughs> <laughs>